Peace, peace, peace. This is your international sales and marketing villain, a.k.a. bad guy, Tiger Toledo. And you already know what it is, man. You rock it with the best. You heard? Tis the season to get money. You guys finish it. There you go. There you go. You sound great. Listen, ladies and gentlemen. This is that time, and which I always quote the famous line from my buddy Bruno from Roberto Clemente. He taught me this in the cafeteria at Roberto Clemente in Chicago. He said, you snooze, you lose. You snooze, you lose. Guess what, ladies and gentlemen? Tis the season that a lot of your competition will be snoozing. And it is your job to occupy as much space as possible. So when they're done with their six-week vacation, right? Because that's what they're going to do. They're going to take a six-week vacation. Thanksgiving is around the corner. I can't do anything. Black Friday's here. Cyber Monday. Christmas. New Year's Eve, New Year's, the day after New Year's, your competition is launching. It is now your prime opportunity, time to expand your operation. Listen, I said expand your operation. You're not, I'm not talking about keep doing the same shit you're doing. You've been doing that all goddamn year. You need to expand your operation, whether it's go, start hiring more people or at least get some more applications coming in to your company. Because one of the hidden gems that a lot of people do not know about is when you're hiring people, you're actually, this is an art of war tactic. You're gathering intel. You're gathering reconnaissance. It's recon. You're basically saying, okay, I'll give you an example. How can I give you an example? Uh, let's say I, I, I'm a coffee house. I'm Starbucks. No, I'm, I, I'm a competitor of Starbucks. I put out to the universe that I am now hiring. Now I'm starting to get a lot of different people people to put in applications as these applications come in to my funnel i call the people back and i have specific type of questions for them let maybe i'm trying to expand my menu and there are some signature drinks that i want to know what the best selling signature drinks now because starbucks is my competitor how else can i get intelligent on Starbucks, I can't just call the CEO of Starbucks and he's just going to divulge all kind of information from me to me, right? No, I have to find the last person that worked at Starbucks that is disgruntled and not pleased with Starbucks. And now I am interviewing that person and saying, hey, what was Starbucks best drink? Well, Starbucks did the caramel macchiato. That was the best drink they had. And it really wasn't nothing. It was just ice water, blah, 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 this and that. Thanks. Thank you. Expansion. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the time to expand your company. I cannot emphasize that anymore. Listen, your competition is going to be watching fucking football games all goddamn day tomorrow. They're going to be getting all fat and lethargic, eating all like goddamn turkey and cranberry sauce. Friday comes around. They're out there fucking standing in the middle of the street trying to get a, a deal on something. They're going on vacations. They, they flew out to Miami. They're snowbirds. They flew out to Miami because it's too cold. They're getting intoxicated. They're doing it all. Let them do it. 
You go the opposite way. You do not follow the masses, man. A wise guy told me his name is Josh Cheney. Shout out to Josh Cheney if you are listening to this. This guy is doing great things in Hollywood right now. Shout out to you, brother. Josh Cheney said, if you want to live with the classes, wait, excuse me for a second. Cater to the masses, live with the classes. Cater to the masses, live with the classes. How can you cater to the masses if you're one of them? So you have to remove yourself and say, what do the customer want? Hey, look, I've been in sales and marketing for years. I still don't know what the fuck the customers want. The customers know what they want. I listen to them. Listen to your customers. Cater to the masses, live with the classes. I'm telling you again, this is the season to get this money. You don't have to be running around, hustling, ripping and running and all that shit. Sit down and ponder and strategize and strategically think. If you were thinking about hiring a coach, go hire that coach. If you were thinking about getting into Google advertisement, do that shit. It is time to expand your operation. If you were thinking about purchasing a certain book or going to a seminar for the last few years, Go to that shit. Get it done. Because eight to 12 months from now, you're going to be very happy you did. Seasons, greetings, and all that other extra shit. Peace, love, and happiness to you and your family. Yard!